You know, one of the things I love about my life is that I get to meet some of the most incredible people. Everyone that's ever been on my list that I've wanted to meet, I've pretty much met. How cool is that? I am so excited because my latest crush is Leroy Campbell. Leroy Campbell is literally an American treasure, an African-American painter and artist that I've been in love with for years. My mission in life was to own one of his paintings. And guess what happens? He comes to Ghana, right? And my dear friend, Roland Martin, of course, recommended that him and Angela Rye contact me so I could take them around. So we went shopping and I took him to one of my favorite little um, fabric stores where he purchased some fabric, which he ended up using in his newest collection. And how excited was I when I came to America to go to Atlanta to visit his studio and have him present me with one of those pieces of art from the art he created with the fabric from Ghana. So after bringing my wonderful piece of art home on the plane, I went off to have it framed and voila, I am going to share the unveiling with you. I feel very much Oprah right now. Whoa, it's beautiful. Look at the colors. Isn't it vibrant and glorious in every way? Oh my goodness, I am so excited to be finally able to hang this in my home. This is a dream realized. Isn't it gorgeous, guys? Oh my goodness. Voila. It is ready to be hung. Okay, let's see what it looks like when we put it up on the wall. Uh, it's not too heavy. See if it's straight. Huh. It's beautiful. Leroy Campbell, my very own, right here in Ghana. Oh, I have to show you. This is the fabric that was used from his trip in Ghana. So the entire background is the fabric. I got to be a part of that. Keep watching this video to see my time with him in America. And the theme was, let us guide our own destiny. I love how he uses collages of, of different things and uh, events and newspapers and photographs. And here's his signature, Leroy Campbell. I'm so pumped and excited. So you you live here? No, no, no. This is a rental. I'm I'm moving now to a larger space. Okay. okay. And it's a work live space over a local amphitheater. Amphitheater. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. yeah I'm okay. gonna be over okay. there. Look so that's what I'm gonna this. open the store. Open the studio up for everybody to come and see. That is Wonderful. so fabulous. <laughs> you just you have no idea. You know. <laughs> I have worshipped you from afar. Oh far. no! And, and, and now and, look, we are here. Come and, on and, in. And my thing was one day I'm gonna have. Yes, yes, it's getting ready to happen. One day. Yes, yes. One yes. day. Look at this. This is where genius lives. Oh my put, God. Once you put it out in the universe, you can't take it back. Oh my goodness. Awesome. Look at this. I just started this one. Wow. The fabric. Yes. <laughs> yes. Oh, layered, the no Ghana less. fabric. Oh, yes. yes. Ghana, Ghana. Oh my God. Fabric over here. He's using yeah. it. We that. picked she this out together. She told me that I was blessed enough to go visit her in Ghana as well. Yeah. Just shortly after she moved here. Yes. For you. Look at this. <laughs> this is amazing. This was, this was Look at this. 
So this is called rich soil. It's called Why rich not? soil. Why not? Why not? Because weren't we on the richest soil in the world, yes. on the planet? Yes. And look, we're using fabric. Yes. We're talking about the soil that produces. Yes. Our people have been producers. Let us guide our own, own destiny. destiny. Hello. I love it. Still doing it, right? Oh my goodness. Paying tribute. This book. My grandmother's. Age. Angela Rye told me to put that book here. Wow. She read this book. And now I have the book. And you know. This is the New York uh, New York uh, New York Times bestseller uh -huh. book, right? It's a powerful book. I'm, I'm reading it now. Wow. Very powerful. And so all this, all, so wait a minute now. Are you ready for uh -huh. this? Uh-huh. Okay. She doesn't know. Just, and don't let Angela see this. Okay. Her friend bought the original, and I sent it yesterday for her as a surprise. Wow. She doesn't even know she's getting it yet. So look at that. She said she showed him the finished piece. Mm -hmm. I told her the price. She said, I can't do it right now. Mm -hmm. He kept it in mind, mm -hmm. thought about her, mm -hmm. and called us. Wow. And said, give it to me. So I'm, we sent it out yesterday, mm. right? So here's the full circle. Wow. Angela Rye, Michelle, introduced, us. introduced me, and we were all at the fabric store mm -hmm. together. Wow. So here I'm giving her... The only thing I could give her oh <laughs> is the reproduction of it. Oh my so goodness. they both got, we all sharing in this moment. This you understand is what wonderful. I'm saying? Awesome. The universe I am so and the happy. Most High never makes a mistake. Never. So I'm going to sign it now. Okay, sign it. It's called Rich Soil. Wow. And signed by me. Yes. And you're going to get. Number two, because number one is already on display. Wow. And number two out of 100. Whoa! Oh, my go. goodness. There this you go. Is a, I'm so happy. <laughs> thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Just beautiful. Shelly Chisholm. Remember to vote. Love it. I have admired his work. So amazing, so vibrant, and just amazing. And look at this one. Look at that, it's 3D. Look at that. That's gonna be so cool. I love this. This is too cute. It's just the first step towards getting somewhere is to decide that you are not going to stay where you are. I know that's right. Um, he is doing a virtual exhibit he has created. You know, I like to document, you know, uh, I work in series like Lawrence. So I use a lot of photo references and sometimes concepts, concepts from other people. And these concepts are all play into the storytelling and they all support, you know, my big, my big vision is how do we, the salvation of our people depends on our unity. Mm -hmm. So mm -hmm. everything is dr driven behind that. Mm -hmm. How do we stay united? How do we keep working and celebrate what we are and what we have accomplished? And what we're gonna do in our greatness. So yeah, I'm motivated by it. So it's a lot of nostalgic themes and scenes and I collage, you know, I use a lot of uh, newspaper articles and, you know, just to show and document 
you know, our timeline and our journey. What is what, this one? What is it? So the name? during COVID, when it first kicked off, I was like, oh, boy, one of these days is going to be a new beginning. So butterflies represent new beginning. And so these two little girls are, are just butterflies. You know, they're going into the pool of, of knowledge and love and pulling out information to feed each other. Because one day we were going to come out of COVID, and we are out of, not quite out of it, mm -hmm. but it's representational of it. So it's about, you know, looking forward to that new beginning. That's what butterfly mm -hmm. wings represent. These are the, you know, hummingbirds is also a symbol of the new beginning. And, you know, we're just feeding on our necks. So they are really just butterflies. And I'm using our people to represent, you know, mm -hmm. the butterflies. Mm -hmm. And, uh, beautiful. It's beautiful. Absolutely gorgeous. Thank you very much. And will you talk about the process for this? Yes, ma'am. So three dimensional piece. Yeah. So this is going to be this is going to be three uh, uh, three dimensional. This is about a family, mm -hmm. and this family is a well kept family, well protected family. The family protects each other with love, and they protect themselves physically. And in the background, you're going to probably see. Other forms of protect, you might see a building of a bank, you might see a building of a hospital. Mm. We, need to, we need to go get, take care of ourselves mm -hmm. and we need to go get access to our money. And you also might see a school because mm -hmm. we're going to educate ourselves. Mm -hmm. And so you're going to see articles supporting, you know, this family in, in, in terms of the legacy of representing those pieces. So I always, I always start off, you know, just sketching it out as you can see and then mm -hmm. outlining it. And then I start from the background and come to the foreground. It wow. feels like a version of uh, Black Wall Street. Yes. You, now say that again. <laughs> yes. Okay, she got me choking up because that's exactly what it's going to represent. Yeah, yeah, oh, yeah. Some of our legacy of Black Wall Street. Mm -hmm. exactly. Okay, mm -hmm. yeah. that's where I chime in. Mm -hmm. The third project that I'm working on is called Greenwood. Oh! oh wow. It's going to be performed live on stage in Charlotte, North Carolina, September what? 17th, 18th, and 19th. Mm. The brother who wrote it, his name is... Coolidge Harris II, he lives in Sacramento. He researched the events leading up to and the events of the massacre of Black Wall Street. Exactly. Wrote a play about it, a phenomenal play that is the quality of uh, August Wilson. I mean, the, his, the poetry, the, mm. the character development, the storylines, he got three love stories that run through it and mm. it is phenomenal. At this point, this it's only gonna be in Charlotte but it's got, well, at Matthews, which is a, a suburb of Charlotte, Matthews, North Carolina. And I'm telling you, and I don't say this about many shows, it's eventually going to Broadway. Mm. Not because I'm in it, but because it is a phenomenal piece. Mm. Absolutely. Wow. Absolutely. Greenwood. Keep mm. your ears open. You heard it here. Mm. You heard it here. Mm. Heard it here. Mm. Right, right, right. And it's like, it's the all same. Right. And we all, we're all living in the same Absolutely. spirit mm. when it mm -hmm. comes to our people. Yeah. Because this piece will represent. That legacy. Mm -hmm. Oh my God! I, I cannot wait legacy. to tell him about you and this piece. Wow! Uh, that, that, that's phenomenal. This yeah. thing is goosebumps. Yes, goosebumps. I got goosebumps too. I got goosebumps. Why, 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 why can't we goosebumps? Yeah, yeah. goosebumps. Yeah. goosebumps. <laughs> Lord, today, goosebumps. Yeah. And the fabric you see there—that the little piece of fabric yeah. came from Accra. Came from Ghana, yeah. and my beautiful sister friend took me to the store, Michelle, where I purchased the fabric, and now the fabric is going to be incorporated in this piece to show our connection to our greatness. Because, yes. Because it had not been for Africa, the whole world would not be what it is. That's true. And so that's a representation right there of our journey mm. to Black Wall Street, to Greenwood, and mm -hmm. to all those other towns yeah. that we know nothing about. about. That's true. We had tons of thriving black communities. Mm -hmm. This is going to represent that. Mm -hmm. And in the, in the window, you're going to see representation information about, mm -hmm. you know, Greenwood, Black Wall Street on this window. Mm -hmm. And you're going to see a black bank. You're going to see a black school, black HBCU. Wow. You're going to see that represent. You might see some people going in and out. Mm. And, you know, just... Everyday people like we are. Journey, our accomplishment, mm -hmm. our determination, our relentlessness. Mm -hmm. Our like, okay, we're gonna keep going no matter what. Mm -hmm. You can't kill. You can kill us, but you can't kill our spirit. That's right. <laughs> Hello. Glory. So, so, who is this one spoken for? Not yet. I just started it. Haven't sold it yet. Haven't shown. You're the first people to see it. <laughs> Right. So right. you know 
zone. Oh, I'm in the wow. zone. Oh, wow. Yeah. And I love this family. This family is beautiful. Absolutely. Wow. You got two shotguns. Yeah, I know. Beautiful. I, know that's right. I, know that's right. I love it. He does have right. two oh, shotguns. Look at that. He's protecting his family. His family is mine. His family is spirit. His family community. Wow. So the narrative, you know, the newspaper article is going to be on the floor, on the on the on the uh, on the uh, porch, and then it's mm -hmm. going to be. You know, some information in the window. Mm -hmm. The narrative about this family will come completely to life. Wow. And as I continue to work throughout the year, I even work on a more larger scale. Mm -hmm. That's what I'm really excited about. That's wow. Really